we start with one of our chart. We want to see how we can look for trade. First of all, if you refer to our analysis in my last video, since the price was lower than this move, we mentioned about the different possibility and we mentioned if you wants to look for buy, the only way is to put our entry above the top. As we can see, we didn't get the trade and the price was keep dropping. And now once see was the next, if we move to daily chart, one thing we need to know that every time the price tag 30 cent, we see the reverse chart. That's mean we need to know that the, that the 30 cent, 30 cent is a support that we want to see whether the price can break or not, okay? And we are not looking for the sell. The only thing is we are more interested to look for buy because in the bigger picture, we're looking at this correction. We want to see whether we can get any trade set up for buy or not. Now, the reasons I mentioned about the 30 cent is that if we get any trade set up for buy, if this is not moving in our direction, we shouldn't keep the trade, all right? Because if the price break 30 cent, the next level mostly maybe we can reach, it can drop even to the 20 cent, all right? By the way, we are more interested to look for buy. And if I move to forward chart, and as we can see, based on forward chart price, I'll most retest the previous low if we can consider this one as a correction, okay? And right now, as I mentioned, we are more interested to look for buy. And even if we can expect the price to drop some more, but selling, we are not interested. And right now, what I can see here, even we can consider this one as a correction relative to this, then the price can drop for sure. If this one turned to a deeper move with the breakout of the previous low, it can give us a better confirmation that this move is done and we can look for reversal. Okay, that's mean from now, if we get any trade set up for buy, we will take it. We don't need to wait for the breakout of the, I mean, for the price to drop to 30 cent as is the lowest price even based on this correction, okay? Now, how to look for trade if I move to four one hour chart? As I mentioned, we can put this one as a correction relative to this move for price to drop, but we are not looking for the sell. But as I mentioned, if this one turns to a deeper move, it can give us better confirmation for the reversal. But how about if the price reverse from here? We don't have any trade setup either for buy or sell. The only thing is if the price reverse from here, because if we get any reversal, it can be a sharp move. The only way is to put over entry above this somewhere around here, okay? That's mean somewhere around 0 0.32 cent or 30, 0 0.322, okay? But we should know that if we want to put our entry above this one or a bronze somewhere around here within this range, what we want in case the price sharply reverses as a sharp move. If the price reverses as a corrective, we are not going to keep our entry above the top. We need to see the reversal as a sharp. And what we want the price sharply break and continue if the price tag. And we see it's not continue moving within the first or maximum second hours we take over the trade. But we need to note that having entry above this is really risky. Simply the price can tag and drop. I and mean, even maybe we don't get the enough time to take out the trade. Okay. That's why whoever wants to have entry above the top, they need to be really careful and if they can take the risk and they know how to manage, they should take the trade. If not, the best thing is we wait for the trade setup, okay? Because having entry above, for example, as I mentioned above here, above this move, is really risky. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any trade or any update, I will share. Thanks.